Hey friends, if uh, volume control is not working for your Bluetooth speaker, then please watch this video. I will guide you to the resolutions. And it's not just for the Bluetooth speaker, it can also be for the Bluetooth headphone or some other device. Now, what do I mean by volume control? Right click on this system tray here and select open volume mixer. And these are apps and their volume uh, and uh, you can control them accordingly. But if you're not able to control them for your Bluetooth device, then please watch this video. So and it also includes the volume on and off. So uh, here's what you can do. First of all, you need to run the Bluetooth troubleshooter. Right click on the start button and select settings on the menu. Go to the system tab on the list on the left hand side. Scroll down and click on troubleshoot. Click on other troubleshooters and then corresponding to the Bluetooth troubleshooter, click on run. The second solution is to make sure that the Bluetooth speaker is a default device. Right click on the system tray and select sound settings. Now scroll down and click on more sound settings and make sure that there's a tick next to speakers, the Bluetooth speakers. If not, then right click on it and then select default device. It will give you an option to set as default. Mine is already default, thus I don't have that option. The third solution is to update the Bluetooth adapter. Search for device manager in the window search bar and open the device manager window. Now in the device manager window, expand the list of Bluetooth drivers. Right click on each one of them and select update driver. First one, second one, third one, fourth one, and then search automatically for drivers. The next solution is to uninstall the latest Windows updates. I'll explain how this is done. Right click on the start button and select settings on the menu. Go to the Windows update tab on the list on the left hand side. Go to update history in the right pane. Now select uninstall updates and click on uninstall corresponding to the latest update and then uninstall once again. The next solution is to remove and re-add the Bluetooth device. Here's uh, how you'll do it. Right click on the start button and select settings on the menu. Go to Bluetooth and devices. If any device is added here, then remove it and then click on add device Bluetooth and then connect to it once again when it is discovered. The last solution will be to restart the Bluetooth support service. So search for services in the window search bar and open services. Now scroll down to the Bluetooth support services and uh, right click on it and select restart. It will restart the service and this will almost surely fix the uh, problem. Was this helpful? If yes, then please subscribe to the channel and if not, then let us know in the comment section of this video so that we could investigate further. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.